got my fucking face breaking out right here. Go out to daddy. Go talk to daddy. Go over there. So I thought that I was going to be doing something and the Lord said no ma'am. So we are finished up now and I think I found the ones. I'm so happy. What is going on beloved girls? Hi and welcome back again to Live with Ty. such a beautiful day out here so today is the beginning of a new weekly vlog I know I haven't done these in a minute but I decided that I'm just gonna get back on the content so um, today is Monday what is the day Monday the 24th January 24th and we're actually back in the Outer Banks right now because we are doing a food tasting we're only here for like literally 48 hours and we're going back tomorrow night because I have work on Wednesday with some clients but um, yeah so I'm just gonna show you guys a little bit of like what we're going to be tasting um, for our food tasting for the wedding we are making a whole video of the experience like we're recording that so I'm not gonna put that in my vlog because that's for the family channel but I'll show you guys I'll give you guys like a little razzle dazzle you know what I mean so yeah we got the kids they look was literally just up and now she knocked out like knocked out knocked out we should have had the um stroller so we could have just put her down there she could have just been asleep but yes, we are at our wedding venue doing the food tasting with the chef. It's going to be our first time meeting him. It's going to be our first time eating the food that we requested for the wedding. Like everything like appetizers, entrees, desserts, all the good stuff. Her doors or doors. I don't even know how you say it, but that too. So I'm excited. Alright you guys, so I'm sorry, I apologize for the terrible lighting right now, but this light is broken and... Nah, I'm gonna turn back on one thing. This is what we're working on. Alright you guys, so... Say. Yeah, I say that. I want to say No. Okay. It wasn't nice. You just ate. No, it wasn't nice. The sandwich? So, not me, but... <laughs> right. Then why uh -huh. I ate the same soda? So you said that you, um, you had, you, 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 you Go ask daddy. Go talk to daddy. Go over there. Anyways, guys, like I was trying. Zayla. Like I've been trying to say. Clearly we've been home for a while. And since I've gotten home. We've done um, some wedding stuff. We sent out an email to all the people who RSVP'd for the wedding to just, um, for them to fill out this form that Hadi created to ask them like if they're still, if they still plan on coming because we know things change all the time. So just to get like a more modified head count. And as the months go by, we would be doing another one, I believe the month before, just to make sure we have an accurate head count of who will and won't be attending our wedding. Um, so we did that, we had some lunch, and then for the past like two and a half hours, I've just been sitting here in this computer because I've been trying to put together a Valentine's Day special sale situation because you guys know the holidays are, well not holidays, but Valentine's Day is approaching. February is right around the corner. It's literally next week. So I'm just trying to prepare um, as far as like business standpoint goes, certain promotions that I'm gonna be launching this week. So I'm gonna show you guys because 
by the time this video comes out, I'm already going to have this posted. So this is what I've created so far. And this is what it looks like. Like when, when it's... And the thing is, it takes me so long to finalize these types of things because I'm just trying to make sure that when I'm doing any type of promotion or any type of sale, I'm not overworking myself to get less income. You know what I mean? Like, I do want to put out things that are more um, affordable for people, but at the same time, like, this is this is all me, this is all my, this is everything that I do, I do myself, and on top of that, I'm still a wife and mom, so my plate is literally full to capacity, so anything extra that I do put out there as far as, like, promotions and stuff like that, I just want to make sure that I'm still getting some type of profit, which any business owner would tell you the same. If you don't want to overwork yourself for nothing. That's all that I have today. I'm gonna unwind, take a shower. And what? Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. And we're gonna watch some power and just chill yeah, and lay down. I said you did a good job with this one. Ooh. Okay. All right, bye, y'all. I'm tired. I'm tired, you guys. Tired. So what's going on guys, it's the Gazella, we are on the Cameron's house, and today, let me know what turn off the mic. And I have my outfit, and mommy, everyone's here, my daddy's in the house, and we will see you at the next video when we come out. Peace. What's going on guys? So today is Friday the 29th, I believe. It's basically, no, today's the 28th. Today's the 28th? I think so. I don't know. Whatever day it is, it's Friday. And I told y'all in the last clip that I probably wasn't going to be recording on Thursday, which was yesterday because I was working and so I didn't record nothing. But I'm here and I spent the morning, sorry this lighting is a little bit... It's just a little bit off in here. Morning, I spent a lot of the morning time um, going to different stores and I recorded a little bit, not too much because I was really trying to focus on what it is that I want for this space. So basically, this is what we have so far. This is the door before you get into my loft, but I have like this area that I was told that I can, you know, kind of put my touch to it. So we got some things. Um, my mother-in-law and my grandmother-in-law. We went to like HomeSense, Target, um, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, HomeGood, Michael. We went to a lot of stores in the midst of like a little snow flurry situation going on too. But um, yeah, so we got some pieces to make it more like the feng shui and the vibes like that. And so Hadi just got off of work, so he helping me like hang stuff up move things around and get this place really feeling serene and rejuvenating let me show you guys okay so i had already had this at my other house i just went to go get it because i wasn't sure how it was gonna fit like if it was too big but this is kind of like the perfect size because you have all the space still to like walk we got this chair from Home Goods, only $40. I actually have a chair like this, like this exact chair is just in a blue, like a dark royal blue color um, for my house. And it's just perfect, perfect little like additive just to put like in the corner for if anyone's like waiting for their appointment, they can sit right here. And over here, what I plan to have is like little um, woven like contain not containers but like little um what is it called not cup baskets that's what i want to put i'm gonna have some baskets over here um i'm not sure if i'm gonna have four or just get two and have like one over here and one down here and then up here i have my reed diffuser that my mother-in-law just gifted me it smells so good it has like an evergreen earthy type of fragrance which i thought was very great for like this environment um so i'm gonna have this out 
well I'm actually not sure if I'm gonna have this out because I'm not sure if like the smell is gonna be bothersome I don't know but for right now that's my plan to so have this right here um, I already had this from my other house too but we just never used it it was just always in the corner and then we got this plant from home goods it's a little small but the thing is it kind of looks cute like I feel like hold on. no you can take them off. I feel like even though it's not as big as like what it can actually hold right here it still looks really really good like, let me close this really quick it still looks cute and then we're going in here so as you guys can see I actually removed the whole entire ivy leaves wall because every time when I kept coming back in here to open up there will be leaves falling and falling and falling and it just was like became a lot of gaps you can just put those on the floor actually in the garbage it just became a lot of gaps in there so I just took the whole entire thing down because I thought it was just doing too much like it was too loud for what I want this room to be anyway um, so I took those down not sure if I'm gonna be putting anything up I did add a little bit of greenery up here which I think is very cute and we're just gonna keep it like that for right now so I do have this space open and this corner open because I'm no longer keeping this mirror in here hey so I'm no longer keeping this mirror anymore even though I love it like thank you there's really no reason for me to have it in here and it's kind of like taking up space that I could be using for something else so I'm actually gonna be moving this out here and it's gonna be literally where Hadi's head is right here <laughs> Hadi, can you take this out so I can show them like what my vision is for this mirror doesn't that look so nice mm -hmm. that looks so nice yeah. anyways but yeah so I got this painting as well from TJ Maxx only $30 the greenery like y'all already know the vibes the greenery and the muted tones muted earth tones I got this gold mirror uh, yeah this is $40 from TJ Maxx too I'm gonna be putting that on this wall like in the center of this wall so wherever the center is that's where I'm gonna put it and then I got these gold frames from Michaels um, to put all of my certificates and my light not my license but my certificates and training completions and all that type of stuff my insurance all that type of stuff so right now I only got four and so I'm gonna hang them on this wall just probably just like evenly space them out um, on there I'm gonna do that this is gonna go let me just show y'all this is gonna be my spa water it's gonna be right in the center and then I may even not have this in here I may end up putting this out there with like some tea I think that'll be nice not tea but like cuz they don't have hot water I don't think so. I may keep this in here. I may put it out there and fill it with something like some napkins. I don't know. I'm not sure yet. And then this is gonna hold my license um, when I do that. So yeah, as of right now, those are the changes that are to come. So we're just gonna get to work and I'll show you guys how it's looking when we're done. Monday, January 31st and as you guys can tell I'm already in the spa no I did not record anything prior to what time is it 148 because let me tell you one thing it was very hectic very chaotic and I really was not in the recording mood but now we are here we are I'm about to finally eat my chipotle that I've been putting off for a whole freaking hour and it's cold but I'm still gonna eat it anyway I'm starving 
And then once I'm done, I guess I'll give you guys a little rundown on what I plan to do today. And I guess like the memo for the remainder of the week. So let me eat and I'll be right back. Alright you guys, so it is def very much several hours later. But it's so hard to literally like... Because I'm trying to make Instagram... Okay. So I've been really busy making Instagram content. I haven't really been focused on like the vlog content for YouTube. But I'm here and I got the camera on. So let's just let's just get it going. So as of right now, I've definitely updated the spot as you can see right here in the back. But let me give you guys a little tour. All right. So you guys know that I'm in law 15. This is the spa door before you come inside. So we're going to go inside. First thing you're going to notice is this new canvas painting that I recently bought from TJ Maxx. I believe it was only like $25 or $30, but y'all know I love my greenery, so this is really, really nice, and it blends really, really well with the wall. And so, yes, I love this. Immediately to your right, we have this really nice, relaxed painting. This is already here. Um, you can kind of see they have them like all over the building. This one was in the spa loft area. So I just moved this because originally it was over here, but then I moved it over here because voila, I wanted this mirror right here because it looks so good. I don't even know if the camera is doing it justice, but one moment. This chair got it for $40 from TJ Maxx. Actually, no, $40 from Home Goods, but really TJ Maxx and Home Goods are pretty much the same thing. It's actually really comfortable. Not that anyone is going to be sitting out here because the way that I have my um, scheduling, it's like no one is going to have to be waiting outside for an appointment because I have gaps in between so I can thoroughly sanitize and prep for the next appointment. But it's for the aesthetic, okay? I already had at the house. I don't even remember where I got it, but I'm pretty sure they have... The same one at T at Target because I've seen it. Um, so and then everything that I have in here, I'll link it down below. If I... Why are you calling me? Hold on. Hello. Hello. Yeah. Uh, you still in Colombia? Yeah. Can you? Uh... The thing. Let me tell y'all one thing about life. Life literally has a funny, hilarious way of showing you that the things that you have planned are not. You know what? God has such a funny way of showing you that you are not in control of your life. He is. You see, like I'm literally pulling up to the house now. I literally did not do what I set out to do from the beginning of today, which was to get facial content to promote my promos that are going to be happening the first two weeks of February. It's just like so annoying but you know what it is what it is. So last thing I'll see my brother was calling me calling me because he got a flat tire. Not one but two flat tires. So I go get him bring him to the tire place. Tire people taking their time drive back and then by the time I'm on my way back to the spa to actually do the service and record the service. My mom was just like, you yeah, know, the kids are pretty, like, restless. Which I know that was going to be the case anyway because they've been with me literally all day. And there's really not much for them to do. So definitely when I have a content day in the spa again, I'm going to be bringing like more activities to keep them preoccupied and just allow me that time to focus on making videos, taking pictures, doing whatever it is that I'm that I'm doing. But yeah. So, I did end up getting a reel though. So, that's that's always good. It was pretty hilarious how I thought that I was going to be doing something and the Lord said no ma'am. <laughs> he sure did say no ma'am calm down sit down I didn't willingly do it but I, I did it 
so it is what it is yeah tomorrow is tuesday it's samir's birthday most likely going to be recording some of that um i don't have anything planned like y'all know it's still COVID out here and it's not i don't feel comfortable doing much of anything especially outside the house um even having like people over the house like that's why i was just like oh we're not really doing nothing i'll call y'all on zoom <laughs> We can do a Zoom happy birthday, and that it is what it is. This year is just different. Hopefully, next year things are a little bit more easier in society. I don't know. You see your toys? That was a sweet toy when she was a baby. Now they're your toy. Now you guys can see it. I mean. Let me see. Come here. Don't pop it. Come here. This is not to work. Come here. What is going on, you guys? Today is Wednesday, February 2nd. Happy Black History Month, happy Love Month. As you guys can see, I added a little bit more, a little bit more touches and made it not as congested. So like over here, I have the circle mirror with the gold accent and then the greenery around it. Hadi actually came up with this idea, so shout out to you, babe. Um, I have my gold... Um, picture frames which I got from Michaels in the wall there she is she is so cute let me talk to you guys so yeah I am very pleased with how everything has turned out um, it's I'm making it more my sacred healing space which is the whole goal of this whole transition into this new um, loft area for my business and it is going on the third week on this coming up Sunday will make three weeks since being in here already and then literally the next week after is like a whole month so the time is moving by super super fast um, but I'm so grateful to just be able to curate the space that makes me ha the happiest um, that makes me happy and enjoyable to come to work every single day and it's just like I feel like it speaks me and I feel like when people come in like there was just um, someone in here showing like the other lofts that are still available and I guess she didn't realize that I was here but I was out there setting up some stuff out there in the um, spa lounge area and so I, she seen me and she came back I was like come on come on come check it out and um, the lady who is a stylist um, who may be potentially coming in like renting a room here too um she was just saying like wow this is so nice it's just so inviting and that's the exact feeling that I want people to feel when they come and book with Vianna Beauty and she was not even a client it was just a random person just happened to casually walk by I told them to come check it out and just her energy um just like looking at, at the space and, and being within the space, just that's everything. That is everything to me. And that's what I'm aiming for when I am in the, when I'm like taking my time, picking out certain pieces to make the experience something memorable. Because that, that's the key to keep getting people to come back. Make the experience memorable and they're going to keep coming back. Make them feel good, make them feel happy. And they're gonna keep coming back and that's what I do best but um yeah so today is the first day of the six days of love um, which is my Valentine's Day special it's going to be going on for the next two weeks so the remaining of this week and then next week is going to be ending on Saturday February 12th um, and then I don't work on Valentine's Day, which is a Monday anyway I'm gonna be doing my own thing with my boo but yeah so for the next I I decided to call it six days of love because um, I'm working six days and those are the only six days that this special is going to be going on. So yeah, I tried to add a little bit of like 
you know valentine's day touches you guys see i have like the roses in there and then i also have like little goodie bags that i'm going to be giving out to my clients um with some skincare goodies and some body care goodies and a thank you card for booking with me and booking my special because that means so much to me yeah this morning I didn't record nothing because it was just like when you don't have a steady flow and you're still trying to figure out your flow it's like annoying to vlog that process because like I'm just really just trying to get out the house but I'm gonna give it the rest of this week and then hopefully sometime next week I will be more like in a flow and do more things like pack lunch before the night that I'm supposed to be working so it can just be an easy like one two put it in a bag um maybe even pack the car before I even go because that saves me a lot of time and energy in the morning getting the kids ready getting myself ready and Hadia's already working throughout that all of that all of that morning time anyway so yeah I'm so happy mm -mm. I didn't even vlog on this camera, but what's going on, beloved? It's your girl, Ty, and welcome back again to Live with Ty. I literally did not vlog all day today because I was so busy making real content, and we were literally just talking about this, how when you get so flustered doing one type of content, you forgot about the other type of content. So, I'm sorry, but today... Well, it's nighttime now, but today I took some pictures, posted on the gram. If you guys aren't following me on Instagram, follow me at Ty Imani. And now we're about to sit here and eat. We got some hook and rail. Oh, by the way, I'm with your girl, naturally not sunny. <laughs> and we got some hook and rail. This is our first time having this seafood boil. So we're gonna see what it's giving, if it's really giving the girls what they're supposed to have gave. It smells good though. It oh, does. Got, oh, we got plastic. We using the plastic. Okay. <laughs> let me see what I got. So let me tell y'all what I got. Cooking real. I'm very excited okay. to see this is how it tastes, like how the sauce tastes, if it's up to my spice tolerance. Because sometimes they be saying it's spicy, but it don't really be too spicy. It'd be real, like, greasy. Mm -hmm. and I don't like that. And crab legs, some shrimp, corn, mozzarella sticks. Let's see. Is the rice good? I don't even know yet. Some mozzarella sticks, some rice. I never had rice in my boil. But Tia was talking about, do they have rice? I'm like, mm -hmm. yeah. Do you just eat it by itself or mix it with the, um... I think you mix it with it. With the sauce. Mm-hmm. Make it saucy, make it saucy. Oh. I don't got no tripod. Not me over here trying to be like Kayla. Right. I'm like, Kayla <laughs> be doing that. It should be popping up on stuff. Come on now. Look. What's that Cajun sauce? I feel like yours is actually... Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm. So hungry. They're good, but I need the cheese to be like stringy. Yeah, but guys today is tuesday the 8th i believe february 8th and it is 1 in the afternoon uh, say hey zay <laughs> she's stuffing her face right now what else we want to do today i think i'm gonna give zayla a little mini face show yesterday was so cute i wish i recorded it but she called me and she was pretending like a directions tool book was a spa um like certificate and she was like oh my gosh I got a certificate to mommy spa remember come tell them what tell them what you had called and told me yesterday I said that book was an invitation to mommy's fall and I said happy you're so happy 
So, if you come to Mommy Spa, what type of service would you like to receive? Um, well, I don't, I don't like LOL L surprise now, so that what I like. Yeah, but you know the type of services Mommy do? Faces. Yeah, and so what type of service do you want to get when you come to the spa? Um, I want to face mask. You want a face mask? Okay, I think I can do that for you. <laughs> you want to do that today? Um, I think, yeah. Yeah? All right. Ooh. You ready to go? Yeah. All right, let's go. Oh, my camera's about to die. It's okay, Mommy. We can, we can charge it when we get, we can charge it when we get back home. Okay. We're going to go and how do you feel, Booby? Good. You do? Yeah. You're relaxed? Yeah. Okay. Ready for mom to give you your facial? Yeah. Okay. It's my first time. It's your first time? Yeah. You're so silly, girl. Are you relaxed? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. You see? We look like the same. Yeah, we do. We're both beautiful. Alright, guys. So, so, it's 10.47 at night. I've been home for a minute, but I spent like the last two hours cleaning out the kids' closet because it's just been sitting there with boxes and toys and clothes and it was just looking so chaotic so I just I had the energy to um just sit there and clean it and so that's what I did he made oh let me show y'all he made some dinner tonight first the bowl <laughs> look at that he put a drip 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 <laughs> Yeah, you guys, and look at this, the bed's still not up because they sent us, oh, there's so much that I have to update you guys on since we moved in, and I'll probably do that tomorrow when I have some time time. I'm going to try on dresses, this is my first time, so of course I'm going to take you guys along with me, and I guess I can explain to you guys why it's taking me so long to get a dress why I haven't really been motivated to get a dress and all that in like another video but yeah I'm still gonna do that do my service and just go alright guys I'll see you tomorrow alright you guys so I just um, finished setting up the room I prepped for my client put out all the products that I'm going to be that I believe as of right now I'm going to be using on her so I don't have to scramble around later. Got my towels and the towel warmer. Everything's nice and clean. This is coming with me. Let's go. Put your hood on. I'm going to get camera for you, Mommy. So that Mommy is going to stretch up. A new guest is coming later so we're going to go Where's hang on. Yeah. And to that we don't meet i go for a while and then when and we don't meet to at the house. Alright you guys, so we are finished up now, and I think I found the one, so we're just going to go in the front, see what we can get the price to, and we're going to be done, just in time for me to go back to work and get my client.
it's recording. Yeah. Well, let me get mine. I just touched them. at the two. Sometimes I wish